San Battista Valli. Ok. <ride> ok. Hey pretty people, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Make sure that you're subscribed so that you can join all the fun. It's been a hot minute since I've sat down and done a try on haul for you guys. But today I'm gonna make it up to you because today it is time for a try on haul. This one is actually very special because it is a collaboration between H&M and Giambattista Valli. That's the way you say it. I had to practice that. I'm an American bitch. I cannot say this for the life of me. So, Giambattista Valli is who collaborated with H&M. These pieces are beautiful. And if you know his designs, you know they are very feminine. They're very out there. They're very big and loud, which I love. A lot of the pieces on the launch day sold out like within minutes. And I actually snagged two dresses that sold out very quickly. So I'm very happy about that. So yeah, let me just stop talking about it and let me actually show you guys. So the packaging that this thing came in is this big mama right here. Look at this ginormous box. Hugh, humongous. I mean, this showed up in my front door and I did not expect this. So, we got a lot to dig into. So let me open this thing up and let's get started. So everything comes so nicely packed, but two of the things I already took out of the packaging because I had to try them on and make sure they fit, you know the deal. So, I had to do all that before I film this video because I don't want to, you know, come on here and the dress is like too small or something. Two of these pieces are out of the packaging, but I'll show you those first. So, first up is this gorgeous dress right here. This black laced floral detailed dress. It is truly so flattering and so cute. Obviously, it has a fit and flare design to it with the balloon sleeves. Both of those things are very flattering and fit my style, my personal style. I like both of those elements when it comes to dresses. So that is what made me fall in love with this dress. We can see here right in the middle, there is this mesh detailing where you can have a little peep through moment. It kind of makes that nice illusion up front that is very flattering. Coming off of that mesh are those ruffles, which are big and loud and adorable. And and as we look throughout the dress, we see the floral embellishments, which also give this dress a nice little touch. I feel like this dress is one of the more toned down pieces in this collection. Some of the pieces were like so out there that even I was scared to order them. So <laughs> this dress is very busy though, but it is still one of the more simple toned down ones. So yeah, I love this. It is very cute, it's very flattering, and I love that it's sold out because I love that it is exclusive, and I love that I was able to get my hands on it before it sold out. So it does make it more unique and more special, in my opinion. So this next dress, she's something else. When I ordered her online, I did not realize she had all this detailing going around on the neck, but I pulled her out of the bag and was like, what? <laughs> okay, so let me just show you. This is the dress right here with this crazy embellishment up front. But besides that, I'm obsessed with this dress. The red part, that is. I don't know. This top part just really looks gaudy and childish. It kind of looks like something I wore in middle school. I used to wear these huge chunky rings that looked like this. I'm not even kidding. I would wear those to class and I thought I was the cutest thing. But to be in my 20s and to be a mature young woman wearing this around my neck, that's just not cute and I cannot... I cannot do that. So I did not know that was a thing when I ordered it and I was really caught off guard when I pulled it out of the packaging. So that's my thoughts on the top part. But for the rest of the dress, I'm really obsessed with it. So I believe I will either keep this dress maybe as is, I don't know, I really don't think I'm gonna do that. Or if I keep it, I may cut out that top part and then just make it all the red dress. But besides that top craziness, I love the design of the actual red dress. It's very flowy and very puffy. It just screams girly to me and that is what drew me to it. And I'm not gonna lie, the day of the launch of this collection, I knew everything was gonna be gone within minutes. So I was like, all right, let me add this, 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 this to my cart and then let me check out. For this one, I didn't sit there and really look at all the detailing apparently, so. Hmm. If you're shopping online, in person, whatever, just pay attention to all the details and don't be like me because you'll be stuck with something like this. Even though it is pretty right here, you still have that 
in your closet <laughs> but let me show you what it looks like tucked in because it truly makes the world of a difference it looks like a whole different dress and it looks like a dress that i'd actually rock and be proud of so i don't know i see some arts and crafts and cutting in my future because that's gotta go so the next piece that i got my hands on was this sweatshirt right here i'll go ahead and open it up so you guys can see the full effect i really like this piece because it just has giambattista valley on the front and it doesn't say anything about h&m so that to me is really cute we all know that these high-end designer pieces will go for hundreds of hundreds of dollars even just for like a sweatshirt like this and this was under 100 it was pretty high up there but it has giambattista valley on the front and it doesn't say anything about H&M. It's like you just bought this designer piece, not from H&M, you know what I mean? I didn't know what I was gonna get with this, but after trying it on, I know that it is really nice quality and it's like a really thick sweatshirt. And I love that this sweatshirt is more of a neutral tone pink. The black on the front just goes well and it's comfy and cozy. And with the winter coming up, I'm gonna be wearing this a lot. Okay, darlings, on to the next. My next two pieces are accessories. They have not been opened yet. Look at these little boxes they come in. It's just so nice and it really adds to the quality and the experience of purchasing something like this. I really like to keep these boxes and put them in my junk drawers and use them for like random stuff. So these boxes are actually nicely made so I'll definitely reuse those. This next piece I am so obsessed with. So at a first glance, this is what it looks like when I unwrap it. I have to open it up and really put it all together to show you guys the full effect of this. So obviously, as you can tell, it's a little purse. And here is the strap. All right, so I just went ahead and put the straps on. And there it goes. It makes a perfect little purse. It also came with these other straps. I think this is just to have a smaller bag. Yeah. So you can have it as a little handbag as well. I'll show you guys how it looks both ways but for now let me just show you what this purse is made of so first of all the main thing that really stands out is the love on the front besides the obvious love writing on the top we see that this is a clear bag which is actually in fashion right now up top we see that Gian Battista Valley is written right there and a little heart too cannot forget the heart and this collection had a lot of hearts and lips featured on their products like I said earlier his designs are very feminine and cute so the hearts and the lips they're just a part of it and to me that's adorable to open it up we go in to this heart piece and voila it's obviously not that much room but nowadays we obviously are trending more towards smaller and smaller bags we have seen bags this big so we cannot complain about the size of that all you need is your phone your wallet your carmex your mascara your lip gloss and i think that that all will fit in there so it's perfect so moving on to the last piece here all right so this next collection also comes in a box so this would make a cute christmas present honestly maybe i could even reuse these boxes for that because the time is here i gotta get my holiday wrapping and shopping all that i gotta get all that done but Look at this. You open her up and look what you see. Just so cute. This is a little headscarf and this scarf is made of silk. So it is going to be great for your hair. If you don't know, silk is awesome. I have a silk pillowcase that I actually sleep with. It doesn't absorb any of your hair oils and it keeps your hair nice and protected and it leads to less breakage. So silk is definitely the way to go. Opening her up, just even right here, look at this sheen and shine that's coming off of this. Gorgeous. I love this so much. So on this piece, we got the lips, we got the iHeart GBV, and we have all this detailing, which makes it more dynamic than just your everyday, basic, solid colored hair scarf. It just feels nice, it is nice, and this is so cute. So those are all the pieces in this collection that I wanted to snag, and I'm glad that I did because I am happy with basically everything in this collection you know the tea on that so yes darling that is it for today i hope that you guys enjoyed seeing this collection and everything that i got the thing about these collections with 
H&M are that these huge designers who make these crazy designs that are thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars for people like me that would be like a down payment on a house or like a car or something and I'm like okay I cannot invest all my money into this so the good thing about these collections are that they are obviously more affordable I mean they're not like TJ Maxx affordable we love TJ Maxx, this is not that, but it allows you to get these high-end fashion pieces for a fraction of the price. So the fashion lover in me and the broke bitch in me was like, oh my god, I have to get these pieces. It's very unfortunate that I love such high-end pieces, but my bank is like, bitch, what you doing, honey? <laughs> so anyways, this collection was great for me. If you're like me, then next time H&M has a huge release like this, go get yourself. So that is everything for today. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.